if I have a question or I have something, he's going to be there for me. So I always feel the love, you know what I'm saying, and get me confidence to be a, a great player and a great teammate. Uh, fun, fun, you know, like three, four weekends in one team is, is like being in, in a beach, you know what I'm saying, with your family and having a good time. So I feel like it's a family vibe every time. Yeah, because like when you don't defend the coach sometimes, you know, like when you kind of struggling in a drill or in, in a play, they come, you know, they come to you and speak Spanish and it's going to be easier for you to understand. So, it's, yeah, it's, it's been easier for sure. Well, the beginning is always hard, you know. Um, you have to fit in. You have to find a way to, like, be uh, a great teammate for the team. So, like, I'm just trying to find my way to, you know, to fit in. And it, it being worked out really well. So, I'm going to keep doing I'm going to keep doing the same thing I've been doing. Um, a lot of shooting, for sure. Um, they say that prob I'm probably one of the best shooters um, in this area. So, a lot of shooting and about an energy. Like, I want to be a guy who can play both sides of the, of the ball, you know, by like playing defense talk to my teammates, be a leader. So that's all I'm trying to do. Yeah, Trent is for sure is one of the best defenders I had um, I played against with. Um, he's very energetic, like always talking, always pushing guys. Um, so he was for sure going to make me, make me better um, as a player, for sure. He, want, he wanted me to be his roommate. He said, I want Fonzo, so coaches listen to him. Yeah. Yeah, Alfonso, I, I know you, um, you, you're you from Puerto Rico and you've played in Utah and now you're in Seattle, Illinois. Has there been any, um, has it been a bit of a change, you know, playing in basketball in so many different places? Yeah, I always say it's like um, Pac-12 is more like a systematic um, a conference, but this, this conference is like a pace, like everybody runs. Everybody's athletic, everybody, uh, you know, big man can run and jump. So I would say, like, the pace is really, like, different. So you feel like uh, this is better suited for your sport? Yeah, it's way better because uh, I'm a shooter. Mm -hmm. um, and I have to, like, you know, find shots because people are going be, gonna to be on me, no catches. Mm -hmm. So I have to be moving constantly in the court. So that will help me to get in shape and be a better shooter. How so critical has that been, though, to help you find that chemistry instantly with Brad and Bella and with Trent? I mean, They're the ones that are going to probably be feeding you. I mean, Bella always, I mean, he, he, he told me before practice, like, he was like, yeah, every time I see you, I'm, you're going to shoot the ball because I'm, pa I'm passing to you. Like, I know that you're one of the best shooters I ever know, and I have the confidence that you're going to give me, you're going to make me better, and, you, and I'm, I'm going to make you better. So, like, Bella always, like, since day one. And Trent is just a great teammate. Like, he don't care about scoring. He don't care about, like, he just care about winning. And if he thinks that I'm hot, he's going to give me the ball for sure. And fun, fun. First practice, everybody was at an, uh, energetic. Everybody was happy, you know, talking. Uh, we have to get better in some things, some details, but I know in, uh, before the season we're going to be ready for sure. Coach, you want to talk about as well, you know, you guys, they talk a lot about last season and, and the end of the year. For you coming in as a newcomer, what was that kind of conversation kind of like, you know, kind of hearing what they were saying about you at the end of the season and knowing that, you know, you guys were going to be like that? Yeah, he, he said, like, um, it's more about defense. Because he knows like this team got a lot of depth in offense, um, but for, he he said he never seen a, a guy who can like get hot like that quick or or have that skill with some shooting. So he thinks like I can be something very really special this year. Um, he got a lot of confidence on me. Um, he gave me the green light already. So that's that that means a lot to me, you know. Um, so I feel like I'm gonna be a really good key this year to uh, go to the national tournament and be like better than last year. Um, when I was seven, yeah. yeah. What got you into that? Well, my dad, yeah. my dad, my, uh, he's been my role model. Like, I mean, I mean, like everything started when I was like six because I went, I went to the court with him, and I saw him shoot, and I was like, I mean, I want, I want to try that, you know, I want to see how, how it feels. So I went over there, started shooting, and I fell in love. And it was like, you really want to do? He told me, you really want to do this? Like, this is right now is like fun, and you're gonna like have fun, but later on, you're gonna have more pressure. You're gonna have other things to learn. And I was like, I'm ready. I want it. I want to do it. And he started teaching me. Is he still the biggest part of the culture down there? It feels like you guys have been there like, since the start. Yeah, he, yeah. 
without him, I would not be here. He's like, he's my, you know, my idol, I would say.